back to learn our numbers. And our topic of learning today is multiplication. Oh, come, let us sing our tables all together. And where we sing, we march along the line. Let us sing. Two one a two 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 a four two three a six two four a eight two five a ten two six a twelve seven fourteen two eight sixteen two nine eighteen two ten twenty two eleven twenty two to twelve twenty four oh come let us sing our tables are together and when we sing we march along the line let us sing. Two one a two 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 a four two three a six two four a eight two five a ten two six a twelve two seven fourteen two eight sixteen two nine eighteen two ten twenty two eleven twenty two to twelve twenty four. That is the sum of our multiplication table number two for multiplication table two. Today we are learning. Multiplication. What is multiplication? Multiplication simply means repeated addition. Multiplication simply means repeated addition. Multiplication simply means repeated addition. It simply means repeated addition. Repeated addition okay you ask what is multiplication you say multiplication is repeated addition simply means repeated addition okay now we want to do some practice in multiplication for example, if you're given, okay, before I get to that, the sign of multiplication is times. The sign of multiplication is times. Okay? The sign of multiplication is times. So if you're given this work to do, for example, two times three equals how do we do this two times three okay from the definition multiplication means repeated addition it means i will repeat my two three times two plus two plus two Two times three means two in three places. One, two, three. Two times three means two in three places. One, two, three. Now to get my answer, I use my counter. One, two, one, two, one, two. One, two. Add them together, I have one, two, three, four, Five, six. So two times three, the answer is six. All right, we continue with another one. Now, if you give up, for example, four times seven. Four times seven. How do you go about it? Remember, multiplication means repeated addition. That means I will repeat my number, my first number, the number of times I was given to multiply with it. So four in seven places means four plus four plus four plus four plus four plus four plus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It means four in seven places. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Meaning four in seven places. Then I'm going to get my answer. I'll do my counter. Using my counter. Okay. One, two, three, four. 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 One, two, 
three, four. One, two, three, four. Then add them together. Now I want to add the counters together. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. So 4 times 7 is actually 28. 4 times 7 is actually 28. Alright. Now, we want to try another word. What if you are given 8 times 0? 8 times 0. Zero. Now, when you remember, in addition, we have rules. Also in subtraction. Now, in multiplication, there are also rules. For example, any number multiplied by zero is zero. Eight times zero is, is equal to zero. It means eight in no place. That means it is zero. My answer is zero. Now let me give you one what to do. Three times five. Three times five. That is three in five places. One, two, three, four.